Science, Research and Development of the Game. Brought to you by Stewart Golf Dream Machines. I don't think anybody would argue that the best way to play golf is with a caddy, but the days of caddies at golf clubs across Canada, well, they're pretty few and far between. There's not many courses anymore that have caddies. So the next best solution, one of those motorized remote control pull carts. Now, what you may think about those old generation style carts, get those out of your mind because those days are long gone. Stewart Golf has really revolutionized the business and we spoke with the head of that company, Mark Stewart. Well, Mark, uh, first of all, welcome to Canada and, uh, and the, what you've designed here with the, with the Dream Machine is, is amazing. The one thing that I think about this is it, it really kind of opens up the category. When I saw those original models way back 20 years ago, whatever, 10 years ago, they were really, you know, it was kind of like my grandfather would, would use those, yeah. but but uh, really right now it's it's a, it's a category that's open to every, everybody. It is, and it's true that when you say that it used to have a, um, a kind of a, a bad a bad image, the, the powered car industry, certainly in, in the UK as well as here, um, where it was something that people would, would say that they needed rather than something they wanted, so it would be they have a bad knee or a bad back or didn't have the energy or something. But we were looking at the whole product thinking, well, you know what, this is actually really good for your game. If you're, if you're not carrying your clubs, then you're saving energy and you can concentrate more on your game. So we developed a product that not only performed really well, but people were going to look at it and go, wow, I want one of those. And, and the X7, the new model they have, the Dream Machine, is, is really spectacular. Just kind of give us some of the highlights of it. Well, the X7 is the, is the latest version of the X series that, that we launched um, back in 2004. We first launched it. We constantly developed the product to make it better and, and sort of more features and better technology. The X7's main feature is the, the new lithium battery. So we've gone from something that weighed um, 24 pounds to now something that weighs six. Wow, that's, that's uh, obviously going to be a little uh, less taxing on someone to spin it around. It's got remote control. It's got all sorts of great features. Could yeah. you, could you think you can kind of walk us through one? Yeah, absolutely, no okay. problem. So here we have the X7 Lithium, which is the latest cart from Stuart Golf. Here we have the, uh, the product in its most compact folded state. So this is going to fit into the trunk of most cars. When you get to the club, to unfold it is really, really simple. Just grab the, the handle and pull it towards you. Both the top and bottom clips will engage automatically, so you don't have to, to do anything up. There are no screws or anything like that. The first thing you have to do is to take your battery and put it into the unit. So the, the front comes off nice and easy. Move the battery straps out of the way. And you take the new lightweight lithium battery, this weighs just six pounds, drop it into the chassis. We always recommend to, uh, to do up the straps just in case you have any, um, any mishaps. Then you take the battery leads and just plug it into the main power box. Take the front cover and just drop it straight back on, nice and easy, and then you're good to go with the trolley itself, so it's just a case of putting the bag on. We use these um, extendable bungee cords that are gonna make sure your bag doesn't rotate when it's on the golf course. So you just drop the bag on, take the top bungee and secure, and then do the same on the base using the large handle that's already supplied. Then your bag won't rotate during play. Now, now you're basically set up and ready to go. The cart um, on the golf course, we've designed it specifically to be a remote control from day one when we, when we started the design. What this means is that you've got a really nice, um, nice wide wheelbase, You've got two front wheels, which are good for stability on side slopes as well. And the other uh, big innovation on here is that we've got a, a built-in stabilizer. So even if it goes up a hill that's maybe a little too steep for it, it will just ride on the stabilizer until it comes back to, um, come back to all four wheels again. We also have really good side slope stability. So even if you're on, a, on the side of a bunker or uh, some kind of hills, you have to be over an, awful lot, um, an awfully long way before this is going to fall over. Other than that, You've got your remote control handset, so when you're, um, when you're ready to go, you just press the buttons and you're away.